Hello everyone, this video is for the cat urogenital system. We are going to begin with the excretory system, which begins at the level of the kidney. So blood is brought to the kidney via the renal artery, and in the renal cortex lies the glomeruli that filters blood. Blood is then gonna exit through the renal vein. Now the interior of the kidney includes the renal cortex. Once again, this is where the glomeruli are located that are filtering the blood. It also contains collecting tubules where the urine is collected. There's the renal medulla. This is where the loop of Henle occurs, where the reabsorption of both water and nutrients takes place. And the renal pelvis, which is the ultimate collector of urine prior to the urine being sent through the ureter. So the ureter carries the urine from the renal pelvis of the kidney to the urinary bladder. And the urinary bladder stores the urine until it's time to be expelled from the body. The site where the urine is expelled is called the urethra. So now we're gonna move on to the male reproductive system. We'll begin with the testis. This is the male gonad and the site of sperm production. Once the sperm has been produced, it gets sent to the epididymis, which is the site of sperm storage where the sperm is allowed to mature. Sperm then gets sent through the vas deferens, which is the duct system that carries the sperm to the urethra. Along the sperm's path, through the vas deferens, it passes through the seminal vesicle, the prostate gland, and the bulbule urethral gland, all three of which produce components of semen that neutralizes the acidity of the vagina and enable the sperm to swim. The urethra and the penis is the site where the sperm, as well as excretory waste, gets expelled from the body. Now we're gonna move on to the female reproductive system. The ovary is the female gonad, and this is where eggs are produced. Once an egg has been ovulated, it enters the fallopian tube where fertilization takes place. If fertilization takes place, the egg implants in the uterus and this is where the embryo or the zygote will develop. The vagina is where the fetus is going to exit upon partuition or birth.